Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to be packing for camp. I, today, hold up, whoa. So I leave um, next Monday, which is July 18th. And today is July 11th. Yeah, July 11th. Um, so this is going to be kind of like a week long packing. So I'm going to be packing like some of the clothes I need today because I feel like it. But um, I know I'm going to have to end up taking some stuff out because I have to go to cross country practice three times this week. So I'm going to need shorts, obviously. So like there's going to be basically like three different parts, maybe four because I'm going to film me going to the store and stuff. So it's going to be like the basic things that I'm bringing to camp is like my suitcase for clothes, maybe like a bag, like a duffel bag for bedding. So that way I don't have to stuff it into my suitcase, like my sheets and stuff. And I might put some of my towels in there too, because I'm going to be gone for two weeks. And then I come home for a weekend and then I go back for another week. So basically all together, it's three weeks. So I want to make it the easiest I can to like bring all my stuff from the parking lot all the way across camp to where I'm staying because I'm pretty sure I'm going to be staying in one of the farther like campsites. So basically for sit, which is what I'm doing, so like counselor and training, I stay in a platform tent and they're kind of farther back in the camp. So, but first for this video, I'm going to make a packing list because I don't just like going, whoa, <laughs> going, um, like packing I mean without a list to go off of so like they the camp I go to gives me one and then I like to add a few stuff on because that one is just like very basic and I need definitely like more stuff than that Okay, so the packing list is done. Also, sorry for the messy desk. Um, so this is like what I wrote down from the camp website. This was just a few things that I needed to definitely remember to pack. Also, the summer I turned pretty is playing in the back. I've already seen it. I'm just re-watching it. And this was a packing list for a different trip I was going on. I just got back from actually, so I just wanted to make sure I had all of these things because I knew I was going to want them again. But here's the packing list. I'll just stay on it for a little bit because I don't want to read it off. But if you guys want to like look at it, then you can. Okay, so now I have to go downstairs actually and get like my suitcase. Um, I think toothpaste because that's down there. I'm gonna see if this old backpack I have is down there and I need to get some batteries for this camera I'm gonna bring, this digital camera. And I just wanna make sure that I have enough. Okay, so it wouldn't even turn on, so I assume that these are dead. So hopefully this camera isn't broken because if so, then I def have to just buy, to buy a disposable camera because I love having just a camera to take pictures with at camp because we're not allowed to bring our phones, so. I'll be without a phone for two weeks, and then I obviously get my phone for the weekend. And then I don't have my phone again for another week, but I actually kind of like it because it, like, I get to, like, just be fully in, like, the chem screens. And I'm not, like, my nose isn't, like, in my phone. Oh, yeah, also, this is the bag I bring to camp, and I guess I just left everything in it? Good lord, I didn't know I did that. 
Except for all of my shampoo and stuff is gone. So... I definitely need to still get more of that. I am... Okay, hold on. This is a new development. I really wasn't expecting this. See, like, I can't bring that much to camp. So, like, I guess I just leave it down here. There's literally nothing in there. Also, I am deaf not going to use Pantene or Suave there because it's so bad for my hair and body. Okay, this is basically gone. I have another one upstairs that I'm going to use, but I'll keep this one around to use while the other one is being packed. So that's actually a good find. Um, okay, Neutrogena sunscreen. I don't know if it's good for you, but it's full, so... Wait, can sunscreen expire? So both of these expire in December, so I think I'll be good. So we'll keep those. Um, oh yeah, this is my itch spray because the bug bites are- the mosquitoes are insane at camp. Like, it's so bad. Um, last year, I think, at the end of camp, I had like a hundred bug bites on my legs. So we have bug spray. We can keep that, but I'm definitely another one because that's not big enough. Oh, that's a good find, too. they are makeup remover pads which I need to bring. This is gone. So I'm not a fan, but I do like that I found this. So we can keep this too. I don't know, my grandma gave this to me. I usually just take it down to the bathroom with me because I don't feel like, I don't ever really feel like taking that whole thing with like my shampoo and stuff in it down to the bathroom and I'm just like brushing my teeth. So we had some pretty good finds in there. I feel like this is enough for two weeks. But I kind of want to bring one of these. This is lotion. I'm bringing that. Now, I came down here to... Oh, it's literally right in my face. I was like, where's the toothpaste? But I guess we have like a, a bulk box. I don't think I need a new toothbrush, but I probably want to get one. Because those toothbrushes look better than the one that I have currently. Now, usually... I, so last year I went to a 10 day camp that I came home for a weekend and then I went to a two week camp. They were separate camps, but this year it's all like one. We just get to come home for a weekend in between. Um, but what was I talking about? Oh yeah. I'm bringing home toothpaste this year because last year I almost ran out. I'm trying to remember when the last time I changed out my travel toothbrushes. Okay, good. I'm just going to take the purple. I've decided. Now we have to go into this room to find the really big suitcase that I think. I'm pretty sure it's this one. Oh, my flash is on, that's fine. Yeah. I think this is the one I took last year. Except for it looks kind of small. I wonder if we have a different one. Oh, here we go. Maybe this is the one I took last year. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's heavy. Okay. I thought we had like a big burgundy one, but I guess not. Um, so now I'm just gonna compare the sizes to see which is bigger. So they look the same in length. This one's def bigger in width, so I'm taking this one. Okay, well this is sleeping bag I want to take, but I don't know what it's doing. Like, like I know it's drying out, but I don't know if my parents want to keep it like that. And I cannot find the backpack I want to take, which is kind of annoying. And I don't really like rooting around down here. Because there's like spiders. Like there's literally like spider traps. Like, like bro, what? Those things were in my house. So I guess I just used my school backpack from this year. But it's like kind of big. And I didn't really want to bring that. But I guess it's fine. I forgot batteries. Also, there used to be a flashlight here, but I don't know where that went. So I'm going to be taking one of these. There's Scotty. Hi, Scotty. Now, I believe that my camera took... I believe that my camera took triple A's. All the camera needed was a few batteries. So, yeah. So... Ignore like the kind of messy floor. Okay. But 
but this is like the basics of what I'm packing. All of my shorts are here, so this is what I'm gonna have to like pull out of when I go running tomorrow and Wednesday and Thursday. And then these are just, I don't have all the shirts I'm bringing here. These are just the ones that I wanted to bring for my last vacation that I just put here after I washed them. These are my swimsuits, it's just a bra. And then I have some sweatshirts right there, but only one. I'm gonna bring two more. One is an Iowa State one and one is a camp one from last year, but you'll be able to see them when I pack them all. I'm gonna like show everything. Okay, so this is kind of like the setup I'm going with right now. This, oh, sorry for the dogs. These are like t-shirts, those are shorts, pants, and like jeans. And then somewhere over here, oh yeah. These are separate because they're like, final clothes like we have like a campfire thing and these are swimsuit and these are pajamas i was gonna show everything but that's like a lot of stuff and i don't feel like doing that so i'm just gonna make like a time lapse of me like folding it but i'm gonna show you guys how i fold my clothes first to get the most space possible okay this i feel like this is kind of an okay camera angle so basically i take my shirt basically you're going to take the shirt and fold it in half like hot dog style and like line everything up the best you can and then you're gonna fold the sleeves in okay so you're gonna fold the sleeves in like that and then basically just like fold it oh my god okay there we go fold it all the way down and then you can really easily just Put it in there and then you can like scrunch it up and it's really easy to pile stuff on top so like it'll be good now i still don't know what i'm doing for bedding so we'll just deal with that when the time comes basically all of the clothes um so now i'm just gonna get a few gallon sized bags for like my underwear and socks and swimsuits and stuff because i think we have some and then while i'm out here i'm going to get um a trash bag for like my dirty clothes so that way i can just stuff them in there and it'll be better than just like having my dirty and stuff mixed in because we don't do laundry. I'm going to go downstairs and get one of the towels that I like to bring because it's kind of like old. And then I have to go to the bathroom for the other one. And then I'm also going to get a sheet, like a fitted sheet while I'm down here. Oh, darn, I also need lake towels. I need a lot more towels than I originally thought. So I'm going to bring two lake towels. And I like to bring two shower towels. So this is one of the shower towels I like to bring. Normally I bring these flower ones, but I feel like I have some non-flower ones because I kind of want to bring those. Okay, so I'm just going to bring these flower ones up there. And then I guess the blankets I want to bring. One of the blankets I want to bring is up there. And then one I just use on a daily basis. So I won't be able to bring that one until the like the night before like i won't be able to pack it until i'm done using it oh, that took forever for me to say okay so this is kind of why i want to bring like a separate thing for bedding because my suitcase is already kind of full i still have to put my socks and stuff that's going to go in the baggies and i want to try and put my towels in here and maybe a blanket but i don't know if i can because i don't really want to take the blanket separate because i'm also taking a sleeping mat and a sleeping bag because while we're there we go camping, like primitive camping. So this is where the blankets are. Okay, this is the one I'm bringing. This one right here, it's kind of under everything, is the one I want to bring also. Okay, so now I'm going to load everything up into bags, but I don't really want to time lapse that part because then I have to put my phone back on the stand. 
so I managed to fit everything in obviously I didn't end up moving this bag but I left these shorts out for cross country but I'll put them in my backpack or I'll just stick them in one of these pockets and then I just have a few shoes left and I don't know where to put them so I might get like a duffel bag the duffel bag I was talking about to put like my blanket my pillow and stuff and maybe some toiletries because I don't like just carrying this thing but I don't know if I'll be able to fit that in my backpack or not so okay so now I'm gonna do my toiletries because this is mainly packed so, so some of these things are in here because I got from back from vacation like yesterday and I didn't feel like unpacking it all. So this bag it just has like mascara, um, like an eyeliner thing, an eyelash curler, stuff like that, which I don't really use except for final night. And then this is my razor, but I need to get a razor cap for it, which I need to add for my to my list for the store. Now in here is kind of where I keep like my spare jewelry. So far these are the things that I need to change out. And then this is just like, oh my god, I was not even looking at the camera so I didn't realize that it wasn't on it. But yeah, these are the things I need to put in there. And then this is just like, what's it called? Makeup remover. And this is like the big bottle I have, but I don't really need to bring this since I don't wear mascara that, or like makeup that much. I just finished the Mario Turn Pretty for the second time, so now I'm going to be watching Criminal Minds. Okay, this is the deodorant I use. It's aluminum free, 48 hour protection. I also have another one up there. I usually have duplicates because I just like leaving them with the stuff that I take. And then I have this CeraVe Renewing Cleanser. It's my face wash. And then this, I'm bringing this as an extra claw clip. Yeah. I'm also gonna take this stuff out because I wanna reorganize it. So like the sunscreen I found in there, Crest, um, toothpaste, some more sunscreen, this cherry almond body lotion, these makeup remover pads, itching bug spray, which I need to get more of. And then another sunscreen. This one doesn't have very much. Oh, they both have more than I thought they did, I guess. So, and then there's just this little hand sanitizer at the bottom, which I'm gonna put in my backpack. So I'm gonna set that aside. And this is the brush I'm bringing. It's just a Swissco. I thought it was a wet brush, but I guess not. I think it was like $5 at Target. And then I have Neutrogena sunscreen for my face, but I ran out of it on my last vacation, so I need to get more. This is Sun Balm. It's like what I use when I have really bad sunburn and I want it to like heal faster. This bag just has like feminine products. And then this is the night oil I use sometimes, and it so these are the bracelets that I've already made that I'm bringing because I'm already wearing some now and I don't really want to wear them all there. So I'm going to put them in this Ipsy bag. Okay, and then just this washcloth to wipe off my face after I'm done washing it in the night. Now I'm just going to put everything in here and I'll like show you guys what's in where and stuff. Okay, this is what I would use like going down to the bathroom so that I don't have to take all of this like with me and then i'd obviously put my brush but like i don't think it can fit in here and plus i'm going to use my brush outside of like this so like i wouldn't really use this other than in the bathroom so this is just stuff i probably won't use as much and i forgot to put my cotton pads in here but yeah and then this is my makeup stuff feminine stuff do you it Blah, 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 blah. we've already seen this stuff this is like pimple patch stuff i don't know if i talked about this already and i'm gonna put it in here because i would also use this in the bathroom i think i think i'm gonna have enough room but i also need to remember that i have to put bug spray and um what's it called body wash shampoo and conditioner and stuff in there so okay here's it all filled up i think i'm gonna have enough room i might have to take out like the sunscreen and bug spray and just keep it in my backpack to make it fit but i'm not sure yet um this is the mat i'm taking the my sleeping bag is up there but i can't reach it from right here so i'm not gonna get it yet i just realized i forgot my rain jacket in my to put in my suitcase so i'm gonna put it in my backpack that i'm bringing as i not to bring my school backpack because i found another one so i'm going to be packing this list the other list right now so so this is the backpack I'm taking. I don't know where it came from. I've literally never seen it before in my life. It's just a Fila, Fila. I don't know. I don't know why my camera looks like that now. 
Okay, so these are all the things I'm taking in my backpack on these midliners. Um, three books, which I'll probably end up taking them out when I get to like my cabin or tent. And then the next thing I'm bringing is this bullet journal, my bullet journal, a, a hat from Lake of the Ozarks, this camera, and then I'm gonna go downstairs and get some extra batteries pretty soon. This flashlight, sunglasses, and this string. Okay, also this wallet and this notebook. This is not my packing list notebook. This is my packing list, like the one for Cam. This is a different one. This is this pocket. Okay, this is the pocket without the batteries, but I'm just gonna put them in there so like it's not that big of a deal that you can't see them. The bottle will probably just go here. I don't know what happened. Oh yeah, I also forgot I had to put my rain jacket in there, but I'm actually gonna try and fit it in my suitcase. Okay, put them in here. Now I'm gonna put the, like the rest of my bedding and stuff in here. Okay, so this is packed. It has the mat and the two blankets. So I'm gonna carry my pillow and put my stuffed animals inside. That way it's easier to carry. And the sleeping bag, obviously. And then I'm gonna have to try and fit two pairs of tennis shoes and those rain boots in there. And then I guess I'm just have to carry that too. I don't know. Okay, I managed to fit everything. I'm just gonna have to carry that. So, tomorrow I'm going shopping for, oh yeah. I also have to pack this. This is my goober sash. It's really important for next year. I'm gonna go shopping tomorrow for like a few more stuff that I need like Toyota wise and I need to get a uniform for sit. And then I'll probably just put that, oh man, I'll probably just put that with this in there because it's the only place I really have left. Okay, so I got everything else that I needed for camp and I literally completely forgot to take you guys so I can just show you the haul of what I got, I guess. Okay, so in bag number one. I got this disposable razor because um, I couldn't find any just like caps for my previous razor. So now I can just, um, right, now I can just use this razor at camp if I can never get it open. Ah, I got it. Because I don't know, I just have a really, really big issue with like my razor just being un like just out in the open in my bag like i, I don't know why i just i don't like it okay i should have gotten shaving cream it's fine. also this is not like a disposable razor okay next is um i got a deep woods bug spray because we are in the woods and mosquitoes are super bad there especially if she doesn't spray so it's 25 percent deep for this bag, I'm trying out this new body wash because I have kind of some bad backing, so I'm just trying to see if this works. It's the Perfector Solidic Acid Body Wash. There you go. Don't have to focus. Also, it's backwards. And I just got a small bottle of mouthwash because I don't really use it that often. And then this is my sunscreen that I needed to get more of that I think I was talking about previously in the video. So it's just Neutrogena Hydro Boost. This is SPF 50, but I think my other one was 30. And then I also got my Ipsy bag recently. So I wanna, I'm putting some stuff from that in there. So I'll update you guys, I guess. Next is this L'Oreal Frizzify Conditioner. I like it cause it's sulfate free. And it's like better for your hair. This is the shampoo. Okay. Okay, so the thing I'm using, I'm putting in there is like, I don't really know what it does. I just, I mean, I don't really know what to call it, but it like makes your skin better. And then, oh, oh. this serum, Evil Skin Care. So I'm gonna put those two things in this like everyday bag that I'm gonna bring down to brush my teeth and stuff and then I'm also gonna put these cotton swabs in there because 
they go with that and then i'm also gonna put my mouthwash in there okay and then a few things i'm going to be taking out i'm going to be putting all of my sunscreen and bug spray in my backpack so that way it's not like with the stuff that i'm gonna put on my face and then i just recently got more feminine products so those also they were too big to fit in a bag together and yeah that's just my makeup remember so this is what it looks like oh wait i forgot this bag okay so these are the shorts that i got for my sit uniform they have to be khaki and um they're from walmart my friend just brought them to me because we couldn't find them anywhere so when she did find them for hers she just got a pair for me so but um we are leaving soon to go get like my polo that i need from old navy i think hopefully they have a polo there but if not i think well i don't know why my face sounded like that i think that if they don't my friend said um <laughs> that kohl's had some okay so this is the polo i got it from kohl's um yeah so that's really everything that i need to pack so i'm basically done this is all my stuff it's just kind of thrown about everywhere so yeah i'm very excited to go oh my god i also got starbucks my order is an iced chai latte with chili vanilla, cold, cold foam, and oat milk. So that's everything for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye!